Hey guys, McMull2 here. So, Lore of Hunger event number four is up. We're gonna go ahead and get into it. Gonna run all four tiers this morning. No, those look bad. Let's see who else we got. Yeah, sure, let's use Remon's Boba Fett here. And what we'll do is we'll run a Princess Zodi just to see how it does. Should do pretty good with the uh, with the Boba Fett lead in there. Gonna be dealing massive damage, hopefully, maybe. Oh, and my dog is here. The dog says hi. Yes. You know, thinking about it now, I probably should not have used uh, used Remon first thing. Oh well. So lots of Sith troopers, lots of Sith assassins. Oh, there's gonna be Count Dooku and Savage, it seems, on the uh. On the final tier, or uh, for tier or for encounter number two, and then yeah, all right, this makes sense. I apparently am not paying enough attention to my dog because now she wants to sit in my lap and get her head scratched. So now I must I must accommodate her on this, and she keeps falling around everywhere. Let's see who else can we use? Well, let's just use... I don't need something strong yet. Should have used that Boba Fett for the final, uh, final tier that would have made things so easy. We'll see. That's weird. I thought they only got their taunt from... Uh, Oh no, it's when Sith fall below 50% health, that's when they can taunt as well. Now it makes sense. Easy enough. Now, it seems apparently that you're going to get a three-star Darth Nihilus at, um, at 20 shards, I believe. So, it's going to be just like Sith Trooper and Sith Assassin. So, if you want to go for them, you're going to need to do... Uh, if you want to go for them for seven star, you're going to need to spend about $500 per character. Actually, I think it's about 400 450 somewhere in there, which is... Con uh, considerably better than last time, considering it was 3,000 to get them, or no, I'm sorry, it was like 1,000 to get them both up to, uh, to, um, what's its face? Yeah. Really, really good talking there, McMull, that was great, that was beautiful. Um, yeah, no, it was, it was 3,000 crystals to get them for their, uh, for seven stars, it was, I think, approximately, what, $1,100 total to get them up there? It was kind of ridiculous. Lay it with the triple tap. So, someone brought it up the other day. Uh, it doesn't actually seem like too crazy of an idea. Um, so, using Newt Gunray as your lead and have him uh, fighting... Uh, have him in there with Leia and Stealth or and Sith Assassin and the sheer amount of what's going on because New Gunray's lead he gives Stealth allies fifty five percent crit chance with thirty percent turn meter gain on each critical hit they do. Can you imagine that with Leia between that and her Omega on her basic and if she has the crit chance up buff from her basic attacks, she's basically just gonna be a machine gun and just how disgusting that sounds. She makes, if she gets a triple tap, she has to get at least one 10% turn meter gain in there from her attacks. I mean, you're basically talking, um, you're basically talking she would just go right again. Just straight after she attacks, she just go again and just wreck somebody. So we're going to use Anakin here since he's got the crit damage buff up on clones. We'll see how well this does. Oh, look, a penny. Yay, I'm rich. Now I can afford to 7-star Nihilus. Except not really. It was a joke. Maybe.
Oh wow, that was a lot of, uh, a lot of damage. 24k on that, uh, clone sergeant hit. Also, Anakin lead, so, you know. Ugh, I hate that. If it's a dodge for Cody's basic attack, he doesn't even get any turn meter. That's the worst. Leia may die here. This is no bueno. Yeah, be careful. Take out Maul first. Oh, wow. That was easy. So yeah, that was it. Wow, that was incredibly easy and fast. Um, so yeah, let's take a look at Nihilus. Let's see what we got here. My dog is finally eating her food in the background. She got tired of me. Went to her other mistress, the uh, the food bowl. She's such not a whore. Let's see, can I get him all the way up? Hmm. Let's see, we'll start there. Yeah, sure, we'll why not. We'll go for it. No, oh, why did I hit find? I only have 230 of those. Not enough. Have to get more of those soon. Maybe. It's a joke. Partially. So much white gear. Uh-oh. I'm so bad. I'm so bad I'm already running out of green gear. No excuse. No. Equip. Thank you. Mm. Yeah, look at that. 2,700 of those things. I don't even know what I'm supposed to do with that. Nope. Not a hard battle. Any dark side battles? Nope. Okay. Throw that on him and call it a day. But, anyways, guys, so... I'm just going to be just throwing some more gear on him until, uh, until I get bored. But, yeah, guys, thanks a ton for watching. This is just a quick uh, run-through of the Lord of Hunger event. As you can see, it's incredibly easy, just like that new Places of Power event. All of it's really, really easy. So, yeah, uh, feel free to like and subscribe. Keep an eye out for more stuff in the near future. And I will talk to you guys later.